Aloha everyone, my name is Erica and I'm a marine mammal specialist here at Dolphin Quest Hawaii located at the magnificent Hilton Waikoloa Village and you're watching a night in the life of a marine mammal specialist. Tonight you'll be joining us to get a glimpse firsthand at another part of the incredible prenatal care that we're able to offer Kona here at Dolphin Quest Hawaii. Tonight marks our first night of overnight observations where we'll have staff on site all evening to make sure that we're here to catch the very moment that that little one makes its way into the world. As our daytime staff is winding down and getting ready to go home for the evening, our nighttime crew is coming in, which includes me and a few others, to make sure that we can have eyes on this lovely lady as she gets her rest for the evening, and so we can be here to catch the moment that that baby emerges. Let's head on over and take a look at the lagoon before the sun starts to go down. The docks are prepped and Kona is hanging out with her daughter Halia in the lagoon for the evening. Over the years, Kona has inspired guests from all over the world to care about and help protect marine mammals and our oceans. While I get ready for our overnight shift, take a look at these lucky guests meeting Kona for the first time and getting to feel her baby kick. And so Kona is actually expecting and so she is due any moment. Wow. Yeah. help by things that you do every day in your life to help out animals in the ocean. Use less plastic, recycle more. <laughs> That's awesome! Aloha everyone. We are officially underway with our overnight calf watch in anticipation of the delivery of Kona's calf. Um, you'll notice behind me that our lagoon is brightly lit up so that we can observe her overnight. And we're taking detailed observational records on her behavior throughout the night so that as she starts to get closer to labor and delivery, we're well aware and ready for that moment. We'll be watching for Kona doing any spinning, any tail standing, giving herself back rubs or belly rubs on anything in her environment, and also, and most importantly, looking for any arching or crunching as those larger contractile events start to take place. As the delivery of the baby gets a little bit closer, these behaviors will start to increase in duration and in frequency, and that'll be a huge indicator to us that the baby is on the way. Why don't we head down to the docks and take a look at what's going on? Sarah, is there a baby yet? Not yet. At this point during our overnight calf watch, we're mostly watching Kona take her rest for the evening. Did you know dolphins utilize a process called unihemispheric slow wave sleep to get their rest throughout the evening? What this means is that they're only going to rest one hemisphere of their brain at a time, with the other hemisphere being active and awake so that they can still be swimming, surfacing to take those breaths, and watching out for predators or baby or whoever else might be in their social group. If you watch long enough, you might even get lucky enough to see that corresponding eye close to the hemisphere of the brain that's resting at that current point in time. So these guys are literally sleeping with one eye open. We're out by the lagoon with Kona. It's 5 a.m., morale is high, energy drink supplies are low. We're in the home stretch tonight. As we continue with our shifts here through the night, a great pick-me-up comes during our morning fish prep where we're going to sort every single fish that all of our dolphins eat throughout the day. Today, it's just going to start a little earlier than normal. You'll get a glimpse of that firsthand as we get ready to prepare all of our fish for the day. Mm -hmm. 
With our daily fish prep complete and the sun starting to rise here over Dolphin Quest Hawaii, it will only be a few hours until our daytime staff starts to roll in to take over the watch on Kona and we will go home for some much needed rest. We're excited to see over the next few days how Kona will progress and we're even more excited to welcome the new addition to our ohana here at Dolphin Quest Hawaii. Aloha! Sarah, is there a baby yet? Not yet. Katie, is there a baby yet? <laughs> no, not yet. Nahele, is there a baby yet? <laughs>